And today, I'm going to be reacting to C Blue, reacting to Set the Trend. This, you feel me? Well, his, 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 his little freestyle and shit, you feel me? Respectfully, you a bitch. <laughs> yeah, nigga called him a bitch. <laughs> Without further ado, man, let's get straight to it and see what's going on. These niggas, I go for these niggas. <laughs> They always go back and forth, bro. Back with yeah. another video. It looks like we went from SETI Blue to SETI versus Blue. Set the trend, has went on hazard lights, and responded to B-Love. But in responding to B-Love, he ended up seemingly dissing C-Blue. And C-Blue ended up responding. If you're confused, basically a couple months ago, B-Love would go and shoot a video on a platform known as Hazard Lights. And he would diss Set the Trend, sparking a back and forth between the two, B-Love and Set the Trend. And eventually set the trend would call out C Blue for not taking his side in the situation, which would lead to a back and forth between C Blue and Set the Trend, where eventually Set the Trend would go on live and apologize to C Blue. And that was the last we heard from this situation. And around that same time, Hazard Lights, the person that shot it goes by OA. He would post to his community tab and make multiple updates on his Set the Trend Hazard Lights seemingly being response to B-Love. Initially, he made this post saying, Lol, don't hold me to this, but I'm about to shoot a part two with Seti right now, and I think he might respond to B-Love. I don't know though, I haven't heard the song yet, we'll keep y'all posted. Him keeping us posted, he would then post Seti part two tomorrow. But that video would never drop after Set the Trends Manager with DMOA, the owner of Hazard's Lights, saying, I need you to hold off on a video till I have this meeting with the label. And then OA's hands would be tied and he wouldn't be able to release it because if he was to release it, the label could strike his video down or do further damage to his channel. And then he would later give us an update on the SETI video saying they are having a label meeting tonight or tomorrow. I, I mean, not really. That's not how it works. Like, if the song is recorded, I don't know how this nigga does this shit. If he... Like, brings them niggas in the studio, picks his own beat for them, and all that shit. If he does it that way, like, he brings them to the studio, he pays for the session, he is his beat, and all that shit, the label can't take shit down. That's not how it works. About what? I don't know. But they supposed to let me and know. Even if they did, because you got some labels that's bold like that. Just because they signed the artists, they got labels that do shit like that. But you niggas got to take it on some legal shit. You take it on some legal shit, you definitely get in the bag off it. No cap. I ain't even supposed to be telling you niggas this type of shit, but yeah, you definitely get in the bag off if you take them niggas to court. If you if you own that beat and you own that shit, don't give a fuck if that nigga voice is on that shit, nigga. They don't own that nigga voice, my nigga. And y'all know I keep y'all posted. And then he'll let the fans know that it was most definitely a response to B-Love though. And we wouldn't hear about it until last week where OA would give an update saying shot with SETI again yesterday. New version of part two on the way. And then you post, not gonna lie, this episode with SETI fake mixy LMAO. I just hope the labels don't stop me from being great again. And y'all probably wondering why I brought this up. Maybe some of y'all just don't understand what I'm trying to get at. Basically... The Hazard Lights platform that, that B-Love did set the trend on, set the trend, hit up the same platform to get on there only days after B-Love did set the trend. And in doing so, set the trend and Hazard Lights shot the video. The label blocked it from coming out. Two months after, set the trend and Hazard Lights reshot a video to the same song and then they released it, including the B-Love disc. But it also seemed like he did see Blue on the track. Here that goes. I never wanted to get out of pocket. 10k, what you spend on your jewelry? 100k, nigga, who was fooling? Had to realize it was you to me. Fell apart, tell me where's the unity? Anything that I ever did for you, that was straight from the heart. Can't tell me that a nigga selfish. They ain't laying a hand, I had to help you. Don't ever try to disrespect me. On the media, look like we besties. Got some butter, no ozone. Do his flexing. Never gave me a dollar. But I never hated. Back door closed, I locked it. Cut him off for kill him on the option. Cause I know these niggas are applying. Be the niggas close, you gotta watch them. Ain't no love in this the imposters. Watch your surroundings. I would have never heard a buddy if it wasn't for Flocker. Chatting on the gram, I was in the PNB, smoking a partner. You said that you in a box? You never said that to my face. You better stay in your place. Talk about hollows, that's not your lane. I know you really a lame. And you told me you don't even know the n you jacking. That's shame. Heard he love, all that was fool. You never pick up a deuce when cool. Two, three shots. Watch how I move. I ain't responding no more. Play cool. And after this would drop, C Blue would be doing a subathon on Twitch, meaning he would be live 
during the time this video would drop and would get multiple phone calls to react to it and he would do so but i'm not gonna play that part here it's at the end of the video it's what? like 15 minutes long so oh. i'm gonna let that rock at the end but he also reacted on his story saying respectfully y'all can't come back from this word hunter emoji hope it was worth it and it said the shen would make an ominous post saying whatever's in the dark comes to the light always see blue would then post saying anyone condoning that you shot y'all don't want to fight so they do the net and then b love would post his invoice from eliante responded to set the trend saying he spent 10k on his jewelry and looking a little closer we see a custom b love pendant 40,000 usd diamond miami cuban link chain 60,000 usd subtotal 100,000 and he got taxed 8,875 dollars spending a grand total of $108,875 and his caption saying let's rap facts and then B-Love continued to post saying should be cap what the fuck y'all be talking about and then set the trend would seemingly respond to B-Love that's what I'm thinking he's talking to saying so we just gonna ignore the fact that he didn't respond to the shit that was directed to him and I think this is directed towards B-Love because on C Blue's Twitch he would say that he's the only one that says that he's spending 100k on his chains but both C Blue and B-Love claim that they both spent 100k on chains B-Love posted his invoice but there was a couple other bars and a couple other disses that set the trend wanted B-Love to answer I would I would've never heard a buddy if it wasn't for Flocka. You said that you in a box, you never said that to my face. And you told me you don't even know the nigga you jacking, that's a shame. Heard he love, all that shit was fool. You never picked up a deuce when cool. And then finally set the trend with say, you spent 100k on a chain, I spent 100k on the streets and my family. We ain't the same, bud. And I don't know if he's talking about B-Love or c Blue at this point. It looks like everybody spent 100k on chains. Shout out set the trend for spending 100k on his family. And then we says, well, I spent 100k on the streets. I think that's a car that goes on the streets. I think he misworded <laughs> that. And that would be the end of the story <laughs> post for the moment. Like I said earlier, C-Blue has crying. a 15 minute live where he's on Twitch reacting to it. And I think he was talking a little too crazy. Talking about he's paying for Seth the Trent's phone bill. And he did a whole bunch of Seth the Trent. Get to the point, get to the point, get to the point. It's crazy how you fall out with somebody and the first thing they do is bring up situations like that. Day ones. And they bringing up situations like that where they helped you with something as little as paying a phone bill. Can't trust no one out here, but I also think the trend was petty for, for even reshooting this and dropping it. You could have re-recorded something or made a whole new diss track towards B-Love if you wanted to do that. Don't include any parts where it be misconstrued as a C-Blue diss or C-Blue can see this track and feel like it's a diss. But y'all me know what y'all think down in the comments down below. I'm gonna get up through a picture. I mean, it ain't his job to sit down and say, yo, I don't want to make C-Blue feel away. Like, nigga, if C Blue fell away after the nigga say, yo, it's all good. And if he's not really talking about C Blue, it's like, what the fuck? If Rock want me, keep doing y'all, keep doing me. Be safe, stay dangerous. Good. It, it seems like C Blue. C Blue being a bully. He not talking about me. He not talking about me. He can't be. He can't be talking about me, chat. He can't be. He can't be, bro. Give you everything. Yo, ma. Nah, see, I'm not even gonna call mama love. I ain't even gonna call mama love. I ain't even gonna call mama love, you feel me? But she know a lot of shit that I did. I ain't gonna front. This is new day and age shit different. Like, I don't know how old his mom is and, and shit like that, but like, growing up, shit that was going on with me and Brody and them, like, my mom never knew about none of that shit. Like, me doing shit for the dogs, them giving niggas money and shit like that. My mom never had nothing to do with that. Like, I don't even need to speak to my mom about certain shit. Like, I don't even speak to my mom about relationship shit. So I don't even know how niggas speaking to their mom about street shit. I don't even... I don't know. Like, I kept that shit from my mom. Anything with the streets, I kept it from my mom. Whoa! 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 This what you doing? Oh, man. This what we doing? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I brought you to your first label meeting. I brought you to your first label meeting. I brought you to your first. Yo, ain't like 
Twitch be allowing nudity and shit? You could you allowed to be on Twitch with your titties out and shit like that? This nigga, <laughs> this nigga got his titties out and shit. What's up with you, man? Put on a white beater or some shit, man. You act like you in shape and shit. You got titties and shit, bro. Tuck some shit to him. Get a train them, bro, or some shit. Like, you wildin'. I brought you to your first label meeting. This is not what we doing. Oh my God, this is not what we doing. This is not what we doing. Yo, this nigga did not want to fight, but he wanted to go make songs, bro. Like, this is the I don't like, bro. This is I don't like, bro. You didn't want to fight, bro. And this is what you going to go do, bro. You going to go make a song, bro. You you going to go make a song, bro, in GTA, bro. You going to you gonna go make a song, bro, that ass, bro. You going to go make a song, bro. Regardless of this is old, bro. Why would you tell him to drop it, bro? Like, come on, bro. Come on, you don't do it like that. Yeah, that's what I understand. How saying in GTA helps you in, on Twitch, like when you say some TOS shit. How does it help you? That, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, because it's a lot of shit I can say, bro. It's a lot of shit I can say, bro. But I ain't even gonna do that, bro. I ain't even gonna do that, bro. Niggas know, bro. No, bro. I had son. I had son on my phone. Like, come on, bro. I, I'm not even gonna do this, bro. I'm not even gonna. You do gonna this, say bro. you ain't gonna do it, but you say you did. Over a year, bro. For over a year, I was paying the phone bill, bro. I All right. If I'm not mistaken, I pay. I'm very attentive. You feel me? I pay attention. So he's about to say I had him on my phone line, and then he said he paid his phone bill for a year. He might have had him. You know where you could get the free line and shit. It might have been one of those situations where you could get the free line. He had the free line. He gave it to Brody and shit. But he say uh, he 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 changed it up. He's about to say I had I had him on my lump. I, I was paying his phone bill for a year. Like pay attention, listen. Phone Look. Bro. I, I'm not even gonna do this, bro. I'm not even gonna do this, but I was paying the phone bill for over a year, bro. Look, hold up, bring it back. I had son, I had son on my phone. Like, come on, bro. Look, like, see, I, I had son on my phone. Uh, he's about to see, baby. You know we add the extra law to tell you. That's what he's about to say. I'm not even gonna do this, bro. I'm not even gonna do this, bro. Technically, you was paying your phone over bill. Yeah, bro. For over a year, I was paying the phone bill, bro. I ain't even gonna do this, bro. I was paying the phone bill for over a year, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm not gonna do this, though, bro. I'm not gonna do this. No, bro. No, my mom could come in here and vouch, bro. No, bro. Hey, no, his I mom in the background while he filming. I hear her. I bought you to your first label meeting, bro. I bought you to your first label meeting. Nah, I don't care if it's old or not. Regardless, he should have never dropped it, bro. He should have never dropped it. Regardless of if it's old or not, bro. You talking about TP. You don't you see what he doing? You don't see what he doing on the media? This is what you doing? And you asking me to shoot videos for your album you about to drop? You did I? You did ass? I ain't gonna front, bro. On the real, see blue, like street shit. Keep your mom out that shit, bro. Keep your mom out that shit, cause then disrespect gonna get directed to your moms and shit. It go to a whole different like. Keep your moms out that shit. That's what niggas gotta start doing nowadays. Like, keep your moms out that shit. Your moms don't got nothing to do with that. And your mom should tell you keep her out that shit too. But then again, like I be saying, a lot of people. I like your yeah, parents is young too, so feel me. That's what you doing? It be entertaining. They into that. There's type no way you doing this, bro. I asked niggas to fight, bro. This shit could have been over. I asked niggas to fight. Niggas ain't wanna fight, bro. Niggas, no, I no. mean, if y'all would have fought, it it wouldn't have been over. Like it would have been the same shit. Y'all would have just fought. Niggas did not wanna fight, bro. Cause y'all squashed it. GTA, whatever. Skit, real, no, 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 did not want to do nothing, bro. Like, and then, like, I'm going to just set this shit straight, bro. I ain't going to lie, I'm going to set this shit straight, bro. This nigga did not want to do nothing with B-Love, bro. Gangster, this nigga did not want to do nothing with B-Love, bro. He told me multiple times, yo, tell love is no beef, tell love is no smoke, ah, uh ah. -uh. used to say, yo, my label don't fuck with me because B-Love. Yo, I ain't going to lie, bro. I ain't going to lie, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. 
Eyeball. Shut the fuck Eyeball. up with this. Respect. 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 And that's not even your jewelry. You got on somebody else's jewelry. Nigga, suck my dick, nigga. Suck my dick, nigga. I don't give a fuck. Nigga. Yo, you see, that's another thing, too. Like, nigga, mom's right there. He took her like that. I don't give a fuck how old I get, bro. Like, even I'm doing a reaction, I'm not going to be wilding, cursing, cursing up a storm for mama love around, bro. Like, it's just different, bro. I don't know. I guess I'm an Ola nigga, so we got different, you know? You got somebody else's jewelry on, talking about I spent 10K on my jewelry, and you wear somebody else's jewelry, nigga. You a fucking lame, nigga. You a bozo, nigga. You a lame, nigga. That big ass chain you got on, nigga. That fat ass nigga you got that shit off of, nigga. That's not even your jewelry, nigga. Give your manager his chain back, nigga. Fuck is wrong with you, nigga. Give your manager his chain back, nigga. Suck my dick, nigga. Suck my dick, and that's from the heart, nigga. Suck my dick, nigga. Y'all niggas is bugging, nigga. Suck my dick, nigga. You bugging out, nigga. Suck my dick. I brought you to your first label meeting. You ain't want to sign a deal. You ain't want to sign a deal because you said they was lowballing you. You said they was lowballing you. You ain't want to sign a deal. You ain't want to sign a deal. Now, now you sign. Now you sign and you stressing because your label fuck with B-Love more than you. Your label fuck with B-Love more than you. Now you mad at me because I'm doing songs with B-Love. I'm doing fucking servers with B-Love. You mad because I'm trying to make money. And you... Don't try to make money. How many times I ask, yo, yo, we out to the studio, go record this, yo, let's go make a, a joint album, yo, let's go do this, let's go do this. This is what the fans want. Niggas said no, niggas act like they was gonna do it. Niggas flew all the way to Miami, I paid for your flight, I paid for everything you had to get done. Niggas, I was paying for, didn't ask for a dollar back, niggas, didn't ask for nothing from you, nigga. Like, you, you dead ass. You dead. I ain't gonna front. Sometimes most people might say, yo, don't, like, put out your business with your homies like that. You shouldn't speak on it like that, whoop de woo But you got to understand, sometimes you do things for people and people act like what you did doesn't count or doesn't matter. Or sometimes they act like they forget this shit so much and sometimes you feel the need to have to remind them. It's not the fact that you're throwing it in their face. It's like, What? How are you saying I never did nothing? And these is the amount of things I did that I, you feel me, I can say off the top of my head. This is what you go do? You go drop a, a you go drop this? You dead ass? You dead ass? With somebody else's jewelry on saying I paid 10K for my jewelry and you don't even got your grills. You lost your grills that you paid, what, three bands for in a f***ing pawn shop? In a pawn shop that sold sneakers you got your jewelry from? I, I, I mean, he, that ain't have that. <laughs> like, he ain't had to say that part, but hey. You dead ass, bro? This nigga exposing shit. Bro, ass, bro? Come on, bro. Niggas don't want me to start exposing shit, bro. Word, bro. Niggas don't want that, bro. Word, bro. Niggas don't want that, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Niggas do not want that, bro. Niggas don't want that, bro. Don't want, don't want that, bro. Niggas ain't do shit for they mom but buy them a bag. They hold all, they all, they hold check. Niggas ain't do nothing for they moms but buy her a bag. Niggas just bugging out. Niggas bugging out. I ain't gonna lie. I don't give a fuck about nothing y'all saying. Keep niggas motherfucking mothers out of shit, bro. Y'all little niggas be wildin', man. See? That's why I say when, it, when that comfortability is there, it's easy for a nigga to say certain shit. None of that TP shit. I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I don't care about none of that, bro. Because niggas did not want to go fight. You gonna go put me in a song, bro? You gonna go put me in a song, bro? That ass, bro? Come on, bro. You gonna go put me in a song, bro? You talking about I ain't give you no money off no ozone. I pay for the vid. I pay for the stool time. I pay for the to get dropped. I pay for the beats. I pay for everything. I pay for everything. I pay for everything, bro. Did not want to put no music on all platforms. I was the only nigga being smart, and I put I put music on all platforms. Is mad at me for being smart, bro. Like, come on, y'all niggas is lame, bro. Y'all niggas is lame, bro. Respectfully, y'all niggas is lame, bro. Niggas ain't do nothing for they mans with with none of their money, but but get them a couple pair of jeans. Like, come on, bro. Niggas ain't do nothing, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. All you got to show for your for for your for your deal was fucking three thousand dollars in in jewelry that you don't even got all of.
You don't even got all your shit, bro. Like, come on, bro. Don't do this, bro. Don't do this, bro. Just don't want to do this, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. How the fuck he this, lose his grills, though? Bro. Then you hit me up on the gram. Yo, let's shoot a vid tomorrow. Let's shoot a vid on um, Monday. Come on, bro. You dead ass, bro. You weird, bro. And you ain't want to fight me, bro. You been in front of me. You been in front... I, I, well, I, I don't even remember if we linked that since, since this shit done happened. But, like, come on, bro. You dead ass, bro. I'm not calling him, bro, because he could have called me before he went and dropped this. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Y'all telling me, call him. Nah, bro. Nick wasn't thinking about that before that, bro. Come on, bro. Nick was not thinking about that, bro. But it's weird, bro. What made him like, feel like on, he dissing him, though? It's weird, bro. Mad times, bro. Mad times. Linked up in real life. Nick told you, yo, speak your peace, bro. This don't speak his peace. Every time he start talking, this get shook and start like shaking this shit, bro like nobody gonna hurt you nigga like speak nigga. you you got shit on your chest speak you you talking about you talking about it on in music bro you dead ass bro you dead ass bro that's really whack bro i ain't gonna lie that's lame bro that's lame as fuck, bro i ain't gonna lie bro that's lame as fuck, bro respectfully bro respectfully that's lame bro. i ain't gonna lie bro there's no coming back from this respectfully or is no coming back from this respectfully bro Respectfully, bro. It's my baby. Shining like a slow somebody. Oh, nah, what the f is going on? Nah, today was a diss everybody day. I ain't gonna lie. It's sad, bro. Respectfully, bro. Respectfully, bro. Y'all niggas, niggas gotta stop, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Like, like niggas gonna make his songs about niggas, bro. That I gonna make his songs about me like I'm the ops like come on you serious bro you serious homie I ain't gonna lie you ain't you ain't gonna do that bro I, I know I know I know I'm not I know I'm not seeing this right like I know I'm dreaming right now I'm gonna wake up that that gonna be off YouTube bro I know, I know when I wake up, I'm gonna be off YouTube. This nigga's an asshole. Yeah, this nigga's a fucking asshole. Just told me, told me come shoot a video yes tomorrow. He paused, he paused that shit right with the mouse and shorty nostril. Thought she had a bug on her shit just now. Music video tomorrow. I ain't even gonna lie, like. He about to lie on your ass. <laughs> but you feel me? We, for, we, for, we forever have emotion. You feel me? We forever have emotion around here. You feel me? Whatever I do. You feel me? We forever have emotion. You heard? We forever have emotion. I don't know what is on. But it's, it's, it's all right. Respectfully. Respectfully is all right. Respectfully. I ain't gonna respect. Come on. You going to say respectfully a minute nah, too? Like, Nah, like, I know, I know I didn't hear that right, bro. There's no way. I ain't gonna lie, there's no way. Who you call? But I ain't gonna lie, you need a reality check. Where to the fort? You ain't wanna fight, bro. You feel me? Like I don't know why you gonna make a song about me, bro. I don't know what I don't know what the f that was about. I ain't gonna lie, I don't know what that was about. Man. You gotta chill, where I ain't gonna lie, niggas gonna come up to you, but nigga, oh sh that's how true it is. This is unbelievable. I ain't gonna lie, I'm the only who say that. Second of all, second of all, who who else is on no ozone? Yeah, who facts. No yeah, facts. He got money over the no ozone shit. Facts. Yeah, he definitely did. You on yeah. the track, right? Cause I I don't know. He must have been talking about Clo Visions. He must have been talking about Clo Visions, man. Clo Visions got paid and then give set PC. Cause I don't know what the f that's Word. about. 
What I'm gonna do about it, bro? <laughs> listen, listen, bro. Listen, bro. Listen, bro. Listen. I don't know what the f is going on. Me, I don't know what the f is going on. I, I got four phone calls. Go watch that video. I, I ain't going for He ain't saying shit. But at the end of the day, man, y'all niggas, y'all making yourself look crazy because y'all niggas dead at the problem. And then, nah, the nigga dropped this shit. And then y'all going to start it up again. I don't, I don't know, man. That shit is all lame. Like, I, just get that shit up. Pack it up, man. That shit ain't about shit. Y'all niggas, y'all niggas arguing like boyfriend and girlfriend type shit. That shit is corny. Just get that shit up, man. That shit not a good look. Feel me? But nevertheless, y'all niggas comment in the comment section to me what y'all think about the whole situation. It's your boy Upper Class. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. If you not subscribed to Stella Gang yet, what you waiting for? Come on, join the squad, man. Stella Gang got the city hot. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you notified every time I drop a new video, man. BMG got the city hot. Y'all niggas know what's going on, man.